All right, so we've made our little ceramic Tsum Tsum and now it's been fired. Now we gotta think about what kind of paints we're gonna use. We're not gonna use underglaze, we're just gonna go ahead and use paint. And so I've drawn out, again, what it looks like and then I wanna think about what colors to use and I wanna take some notes on the side about what colors I had. Let me just go ahead and draw this in there. And so I do think that I want them to be some kind of green and when I look at these this one looks too dark and this one looks just about right so I do want generally this to be green and the reason why we're using crayons is it's so much easier to to blend these so I'm gonna go ahead and just color this in And then um, I want to put some brown in on the eyebrow and then like inside the ears. And so I'm actually going opposite of how I would do this um, when I finally get the paints out. Because what you want to do when you do paint is you want to put the dark colors in first. So I would actually start with this darker green and put that in there kind of on these bottom parts. And over the wrinkles and I would put the brown in there and then I would put this lighter green on top. So then I want to kind of think about what kind of paint I would need. So the green that comes out of the bottle is about like this. So I know I'm gonna need a green, but then if I make a color like this, um, I'm gonna have to think about how to mix that. So it's gonna be like a green and make this like a math equation plus a yellow plus a white. All right, and then I wanna have a brown. All right, so then I wanna think about the robe and maybe use like a lighter colored, like a tan or something. I'm seeing a lot of oranges here. So maybe I just kinda of wanna gently color this in. To think about what his robe is gonna look like. So I could lay in the, um, the wrinkles with this dark brown here and then just kind of use a lighter color. So then over here, I want to have, you know, a lighter brown. So that's going to be a brown plus white. And most artists only use, you know, five or six colors. So keep that in mind too that you don't really want to have a whole lot of colors on there just to keep keep it simple so I'll finish this off but now I've taken notes about what kind of colors we're going to use and um, I'm ready for the paint next time